Hello guys, welcome to today's video. My name is Avi Spira and I will be reviewing the Micro Four Thirds 25mm f1.7 lens by Panasonic. Now this lens was my first portrait lens. It was definitely worth picking up. It was my third lens that I bought for my Panasonic G7. One of the only things I disapprove of this lens is that it doesn't have optical image stabilization built into the lens because the Panasonic G7 doesn't have optical image stabilization. But when doing tripod shots or even handheld shots, this still has a lot of great picture qualities. It has an all metal back over here, which allows for a good amount of weight and a lot of quality as well as durability. This lens, and I will be showing images over here on your screen, definitely takes amazing pictures, especially at f1.7, which is a good aperture to have. It allows you to get some more light into your camera, as well as some bokeh on your images. This was the third lens, as I said, that I got for my camera. The first one I got was the Olympus f4.0 to 5.6, 40 millimeter to 150. And I made a review for that lens and why I got it and why I think you guys should get it, and it will be down in the description as well as the eye in the top right corner. The reason why I got this lens third is because when I started doing more and more photography for clients, I needed a lens that allowed me to get some great portrait shots because a lot of the work I ended up doing was portraiture. So this was definitely the lens I looked into, I researched a lot, and it was $150 on Amazon. I believe it still is. I'll put a link down in the description if you want to go check it out. It also does come in silver. I do want to say this is black, but it does come in silver. It's a very nice, good-looking lens, and of course, as I already said, metal, so it's got good quality, good weight. It also comes with this little lens shade, which if it's really, really sunny out there and you don't want lens flares or so much sun in your images, you put that on the lens. And it comes in this pretty small, pretty sweet little box over here. I've had this lens now for a while. I still have the box, but I've had it for at least three to five months and it's definitely worth picking up. Hopefully you'll enjoy this little review. Hopefully you enjoyed watching this video, and don't forget to check out those other videos down in the description. Hopefully you guys will like and subscribe, and I hope to see you more in future videos. Play the outro.